Hello folks, welcome to Sherwood Park Toledo, located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Today I'm going to be showing you this new Toyota Corolla SE. Now the most suitable features on the SE is its heated front seats. You also have your backup camera and your lane departure alert. Now I'm going to go through a couple more features on the inside and outside of the vehicle just to get you better familiar with this new Toyota Corolla SE. Let's get started. Now a couple of the exterior features that you will see on this SE is its daytime running lights. And then if we take a look just over on the side here, you're going to see your 16 inch wheels. Now you also have your integrated signal lamps as well as your heated mirrors, foldable mirrors, vortex generators. And the color we're going to be taking a look at today is black. Now to start off with, we're going to be taking a look at your front dash as well as your front seats just so you have a much better idea of how much space there is. Now you have your black cloth and leather combination seat surfaces and if we take a look just over on your left hand side, you're going to see your mirror controls with your window wiper de-icer and then on the inside of your driver's side door, you have your window locks, power locks, window controls, both your front and rear windows. Now a couple of the controls you'll see here on the steering wheel include your volume control, scroll function, Bluetooth, mode select, voice recognition, scroll function for your multi-informational display, lane departure alert, and cruise control. Now I'm just going to show you a couple of the different features on the multi-informational display. So the nice thing with the multi-informational display is that you can see a couple of different options including your range, sway warning, you also have your current fuel economy, and if you scroll over to the right, you'll see your lane departure alert messages and then your settings for your lane departure alert pre-collision system as well as your meter settings. And if you take a look at the very top of the screen there, you're going to see your exterior temperature gauge. Now taking a look at your center dash as well as your touch panel display, you're going to see a couple of different options which include your digital clock, hazard lights, and then if we go into the setup menu, you'll find your general voice display as well as a couple of other additional features. And then heading into the car menu there, you're going to see your trip information. You can actually keep track of how much fuel was consumed in a given amount of time, liters every one in kilometers. So if somebody does end up borrowing your vehicle, then you can actually keep track of everything. Now taking a look, just down below here, you do have your automatic climate control settings. And then underneath that, you'll also find your power outlet with your heated seat controls for your driver and passenger, USB and auxiliary, mounted to a manual transmission. Underneath that, you'll see the traction control on and off. And at the very top there, if you do forget your sunglasses at home, you do have the visor extenders just located on your driver and passenger side. Finally, we'll be taking a look at your rear cargo area as well as your trunk. Now located on the back of your trunk, you're going to see your rear spoiler. And then just underneath your Toyota emblem, you'll find your backup camera. Now, one of the nice things with the SC is it does have that keyless entry system as well as an automatic trunk release. So taking a look at your key fob, you have your lock, unlock, trunk release, and you have your panic button just down below there. So if you hold down the trunk release for approximately two seconds, it'll open up automatically for you. Now I'm just going to close in on the rear cargo space just so you have a much better idea of how much room there is. Now in the event that you do need some additional space, you can actually fold down that 60-40 split rear seat just uh, in case you need to uh, swap out your tires. And then if we take a look just underneath the floor, you'll find your spare tires as well as your jack and your toolkit. So if you do find yourself in a bit of a pinch, you know exactly where it's located. Thank you so much folks for watching this video today. If you have any questions, please visit us. We're located at 31 Auto Mall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. The phone number is 780-410-2455 or please visit our website at sptoyota.com to get us by email. Once again folks, thank you so much for watching this video today. If you have any comments or any additional questions, please leave them in the comment section located down below. Other than that, make sure you have a great day and I hope to see you next time.